all the employees of the Office of the Attorney General retreated from their busy schedules of running the myriad of litigations that government and private individuals bring to courts through this office. Most of the cases this office has had to handle could have been avoided had its officials been involved in most decisions that government institutions make. Among the strategic review points discussed is the delegation of officials in that office to all government agencies and institutions. Attorney General Saki Shangala explained one scenario that could be avoided by holding such retreats. A woman may suffer at the hands, or somebody may suffer at the hands of an official of state, and you're fighting for $200,000 because you, you, you don't lose the case. But what about that person's life? Have you thought about that? And I'm not saying we have money to dole out, but you must always ask yourself, what is it that you're doing? Is it in the common good? That's why we're here to evaluate ourselves. The evaluation of the office will look at all aspects, starting with the access to modern technology for government attorneys training and education opportunities to ensure constant skills transfer and growth in the office. Shangala says the retreat will consider growing skills in areas the office lacks expertise in. So we want to establish here a permanent committee for human resource, which will include career pathing, training, and to that extent we've already engaged the Namibia Students Assistance, uh, Financial Assistance Fund, so that at least every year we can send 20 people. You, you don't need to leave, you can do it from here to do their masters and PhDs. The law officer's bill initiated by previous attorney generals will also be discussed before the end of the retreat tomorrow.